Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Elty's and Missy here coming at you with a brand new video. And I had decided to do a video going over Tron Treasury as, you know, I didn't believe in the protocol at all. And when I woke up this morning to go ahead and prepare this video, the website is not here. So we're going to take a deep dive and see what could possibly be going on with Tron Treasury. But before I do so, let's say that I'm not a financial advisor. I do not advise one how to invest and spend their money. All I do is show opportunities that I believe that will not be beneficial to anyone around the world. And I also go over opportunities that I believe down that will not be beneficial to anyone around the world. So that said, let's get into this video. So first things first, you go over to the domain. It was registered on GoDaddy.com. I use this domain, uh, uh, this company as well for my domain. And uh, you can see that it was registered on the 18th of October of this year. And it was going to expire on the 18th of October and 2025. So uh, no uh, no DDoS protection here, um, and that's something that you, they should have if they're claiming to be able to do what they're saying they're going to do, which I get into in a moment here. Um, so same thing when you look at my domain registration as well, you will not see my name registered here. But when you go to my website link, you'll be able to see I got my information there uh, there for contacting me and uh, scheduling a Zoom with me. I got a video there of, of me telling you what it is that I'm trying to do. And uh, all this other type of stuff, right? So that you know that it belongs to me. Um, but you know, thing is, this right here is a cause for concern. So you know, before I get into all the information, I'm gonna let you know what Tron Treasury is about, if just in case you didn't know. So Tron Treasury was um, is based on a smart contract. Let's go and put this in presentation mode. And uh, a smart contract on a Tron network. All right. So when you come down here, it says uh, wants to explain what a smart contract is. Don't need to do that, but I will go over this. What is Tron Treasury smart contract? Tron Treasury is a decentralized smart contract created as a community experiment. It acts as a fully decentralized treasury support fund for all, by the people, for the people. In Tron Treasury, everyone supports everyone through the power of smart contract technology. Anyone can participate and contribute to the Tron Treasury Fund. Once you've made a deposit, you will activate the contract code. You will start uh, to receive a 0.8% daily return from the Treasury until 220% is received. Minimum deposit 200 TRX, uh, which is, let me see you on my phone real quick. How much is that uh, the, that price going for today in um, dollars? So that way you can get an understanding of how much you got to spend to get involved with this thing if you did get uh, started. Uh, whatever it may be. So it says uh, 200, what was it, 200 Tron? Yep, 200 is the minimum. So that's going for like $21.55 right now at the current price of Tron. All right. So maximum deposit is 100,000 TRX the first cycle. Uh, so 100,000 TRX, that would be. Ten thousand seven hundred seventy-five dollars and thirty-one cents at the current price of Tron right now, and it says the first cycle. So I don't get that right there. It will get further into detail and see what's going on here. Okay, so all income from Tron Treasury is based on the community efforts. It is a decentralized smart contract where people give and people receive from each other through a fully decentralized system. Uh, so basically, they have no product, no services, or anything like that. It's just People depositing and paying other people to be able to withdraw. That literally is what a Ponzi pyramid is. Okay, this is what how these smart contracts. Last one I was involved with that I got burned in was Tr uh, Tron Case last year. Was it last year? No, Tron Case that was 2021. Yeah, Tron Case that ran for like six months and it, it rubbed. Uh, well, I want to say it rubbed, but I think it, it's just too many people that was withdrawing. And they end up, um, you know, ending. And then they, they launched the second version of Tron Case, and that ended up, you know, ending the same way as well. Not that long after. Uh, so just pretty much people depositing their Tron inside of a smart contract, so that way other people can withdraw. That's that's what this smart contract was about. So Tron Treasury is a community support fund where everyone supports everyone. Okay. So how does Tron Treasury work? One. Deposit TRS to the Tron Treasury contract through your wallet browser. And you know, that'd be like Tron Link Token Pocket. Um, that can be uh, clever. You know, there's going to be a private wallet that has access to the Tron network. Okay. Um, then, number two, the contract code will be activated after 24 hours. You will receive the first 0.8% return. 
Three, you will continue to receive 0.8% return every down 24 hours until you have received 220% of your total deposit. Uh, so to the 220% can be received in four different ways. Once received in full, well, excuse me, uh, the income will stop. To continue to receive from the treasury uh, fund, you will you would then need to make a new deposit to gain new 220% limit. So the four ways is as following. One, 0.8% daily return. Two, 10% direct referral commission. Three, matching commission on partners daily return up to seven levels. Four, daily top sponsor bonus. Okay, so the daily return is 0.8%. You know, you get paid every 24 hours. We're going to move on. Oh, hold on. Let me see. Is there something else there? says, for example, you, okay, that's just telling you an example. Okay, so 10% referral commission. The 10% direct referral commission is, is awarded immediately as the new partner makes their first deposit as well as any and all future redeposits. Okay, so if someone getting paid out profits, oh, excuse me, oh, right here, yawning. Um, so if someone the, the, decides to take their um, their reward of 0.8%, they, they decide to Deposit that to compound, you get paid on that. You know, ten percent of that. And then if they add, they, they add more outside funds into the country, you get ten percent on that as well. So that's how that will work. Then you got the team matching commission, and you got seven seven levels deep of this thing right here. You got thirty percent match making uh, matching commission on your first level, fifteen percent on the second level, five percent on the third level. Uh, 4% on the 4th level, 3% on the 5th level, 3% on the 6th level, and 3% on the 7th level. This is too much. I mean, so the team matching commission is based upon your partner's daily return, and it is calculated and paid out every time a downline partner makes a withdrawal of the accumulated 0.8% uh, uh, daily commission. So the levels of magic bonus you receive is based upon how many direct partners you have. You will open one level for each direct partner. So... The thing is, you don't know who, how much money people are going to deposit into the smart contract, right? So not only are you making 0.8% per day based off what you deposit in there, but every time someone else that you refer or indirectly refer, they're making their 0.8%, so you're getting paid on that. Then you're making extra uh, deposit bonuses based on where they fall at in your, uh, your affiliate structure as well. So this is a whole lot of money being paid out. So they got uh, this illustration right here, but I can go over that. And they got daily top sponsor pool, 3% of all deposits to Tron Treasury set aside in a separate top sponsor pool. Every day, 10% of this pool is awarded and shared among the top four sponsors of TRX volume. The remaining 90% of the pool is rolled over to the next day's pool to always continue to increase the rewards to the top sponsors of the Tron Treasury community. The allocation of 10% is as follows. First, um, Top, top referral is 40% of that pool, uh, that 10% is being paid out daily. Then the second top sponsor is 30%, third top sponsor is 20%, and the fourth top sponsor is 10%. So minimum and maximum deposit limits. The minimum and maximum deposit limit is set to ensure that the treasury and community has a healthy and sustainable growth as well as a fair co uh, contribution towards the treasury itself. First deposit minimum is 200 TRX, maximum is 100,000 TRX. Second deposit minimum is 150% of the last deposit. So if you uh, want to deposit, again, let's say you got started with uh, 200 TRS. So 200 times 150%, that means you got to put in 300 Tron the next time. Okay? And uh, so that right there uh, breaks down pretty much what's going on there. So the minimum and maximum limit of 150% to 200% is locked to all cycles until you reach the maximum amount possible. Maximum deposit at any time is one, I think it's 1.2 million TRS. When 1.2 million TRS has been deposited, the net deposit continues to be 1.2 million TRS for unlimited cycles. So how much is 1.2 million TRS right now, today? Let me, I got, I got my phone out, so I'm about to look into this right now. Let's see, one, oh, I'm just typing that all in wrong right now. See so 1.2 million. Make sure I get the right amount of zeros in. So that right there is almost a hundred and thirty thousand dollars. That's the maximum amount that you can be able to deposit. All right. And uh, so the withdrawals insurance contract. Now this is what a lot of people was depending on to 
create sustainability. It was not the deposits, uh, you know, trying to limit the um, uh, the maximum and um, minimum deposit. That was not going to make it sustainable. It was this so-called insurance contract that it was depending on to make it sustainable. So the insurance contract is an additional feature added for the safety of new users. It will only be activated in a future event that the main contract balance goes to zero. The insurance contract is coded to all users that is yet to receive at least 100% of the total deposit back. This is an additional security feature for new members contributed to, um, to, uh, contributed to by all users in the Tron Treasury community in the following two ways. One, 2% 2 of all deposits to Tron Treasury is added to the, the insurance contract immediately. Got a space right there. Um, you know, so not only when you put in your 200 Tron, they say, let's say you put in 200 Tron, you gotta, they, they're gonna pay out your upline, you know, seven levels above you. But then they're going to take an additional 2% out of that and put it towards the trial of this insurance contract as well. So number two, 10% to 20% of, of the amount withdrawn by users is deducted and added to the insurance contract at the deposit between 200 and uh, up to 1 million tron. So TRS equals 10% withdrawal fee to the insurance contract at the deposit uh, between 1 million and 1 tron up to 1.2 million tron equals 20% withdrawal fee to the insurance contract. So if you got 200 up to 1 million tron deposited, then you're gonna be charged 10% to withdraw. If you got 1 million, 1 tron up to 1.2 million tron, then you're gonna be charged 20% to withdraw. All right, so the minimum withdrawal is 50 TRX, uh, which is, I got my phone again right here. Let's go ahead and figure out what, what how much is 50 TRX. That's like $5.39, that's the minimum withdrawal amount, okay? So the total distribution of deposited funds, 100% deposit breakdown, so you got 5% uh, platform fee, 10% direct referral bonus, 3% daily top sponsor pool, 2% insurance pool, 80% treasury pool. And, you know, you look at all this right here, it's like why would anybody join this in the first place? You got all these fees, you got all these referrals, uh, commissions being paid out. You got withdrawal fees and all this other type of stuff. Why would anybody join this in the first place? So important notes. Tre Tron Treasury is a community-based project, 100% decentralized through the power of smart contracts. Once 220% is received, your income will stop. Force minimum redeposit of 150%, maximum of 200% of your last deposit. Minimum um, entry is 200 TRS, open to all, no restrictions, no referrals needed in order to receive the 0.8%. This is 100% passive. For all members and increase the speed of how fast you receive 220% through a shared Tron Treasury building a community. So uh, this right here is pretty much the end of that. Now they, they're supposedly uh, supposed to be inviting people out to Dubai uh, February 22nd through the 25th as you can see right here. Um, they're supposed to be inviting people out to Dubai. So the leaders who reach a team size of 2,000 members in Tron Treasury will be invited there and all travel expenses paid for. So the round trip, airline tickets, three night hotel stay, yummy food, uh, desert safari, marina party. Uh, we will meet with new investors and our friends from 22nd of February and the next two days we will have a great time together in Dubai and live life to the max. Hope to see you all in Dubai. Let's make this one one of the biggest events ever and let's continue to build with uh, confidence and make sure we can, uh, we can all meet up and Dubai in February. Top leaders who build big things fast will secure the, the trip to Dubai, Dubai immediately. So, yeah, now they they trying to incentivize people to grow, but now you know you can't give into you, your your account right now. You can't see what's going on. It's like I, I even try to go to Wayback Machine. Wayback Machine can't can't even bring up a uh, old website or anything like that. And uh, you know, so I'm like, where where is the former? Uh, where is the communication? What is actually going on? Uh, and I cannot find out or verify for sure what is actually going on. Now, I've come to a conclusion. And so when I came over here to the, the DAP radar and I brought up the, the, the Tron Treasury smart contract over here, I, you know, it's just like I'm looking at, I want to see what the contract balance was showing. And the contract balance was showing that there's over $268,000 in the contract balance. Of course, it's been going down. And the volume is a huge cause for concern. 
because you know this right here is the fiat value of income and debt transaction over a period of time this is over the last 24 hours right here as you see last 24 hours it's been a decrease of 88.67 percent of transactions or deposits going into the smart contract and then you know you look right here the balance is, is I mean this is showing you what the probably what the overall balance it got up to this is not like what is actually in the contract because people have been redrawing right and so you look at that that's a ten thousand dollar difference so the meaning tell me that it's only ten thousand dollars in the smart contract because you look at this this is a total fiat value of assets and depths on smart contracts yes that's what came in probably right you know you come right to the last seven days you look at that 7.31 thousand came in the last seven days you know the contract balance is still the same because that's how much came into the contract in total look at the last 30 days and, you know so I was looking at this chart right here you're looking at this is the last seven days but we're gonna go to all when this thing first launched look at all of the amount of deposits that came into the smart contract look at where is that now so literally like I said you know I just noticed this right here I, I, I just I was just looking at this information before I'm like last 24 hours you know you look at the um you know what's going on here it, it looks like uh what was that it was the seven days that I was on can't remember which one it was but it was something that showed that maybe God uh, uh, was only like ten thousand dollars available I remember seeing that I don't know what happened there to that those numbers because it was showing like two hundred and fifty-eight thousand right here, and two hundred sixty-eight thousand here. So I was like, "That's like ten thousand dollars remaining in the contract." And when you come down here to this graph; it reflects that that it's only like ten thousand dollars remaining in the contract. So use all the way up to what eighty-five point eight eight thousand dollars, and now you're all the way down here to uh, let's see here this. Can I zoom in on that, that bar or something like that? I can't even zoom in on it. Let's just say 10,000. Over 10,000. That's what it's showing right here in DAP Radar. And the other thing that um, I had noticed is when I put up the actual contract and I went to the balances, it does not load up. Could there be some type of attack going on right now? A DDoS attack going on? Maybe. But then when I go to the creator's wallet, Look over here, $246,000 that it got in Tron. So, is this a rug pull by the creator? Or is there a DDoS attack? I cannot confirm because I cannot get access to the website to find out what it was their official means of communication. And I'm, pre I'm pretty sure it's probably through Telegram. And I cannot find any information on Telegram. You know, to be able to try to track, uh, find out what is going on here. But this right here is a big red flag when you see that the creator's wallet has all the Tron. And when I go to the actual wallet, this is the, the actual wallet for Tron Treasury. As you see, Tron Treasury name up right here. It's showing that total assets is zero. They got all these transactions there. And when you go to the token balances, nothing loads up. Now, you can see all the transactions just fine. There's no issues with that. You see the transfers, or well, actually not transfers, uh, internal transactions, just fine. And, you know, so you go to the contract, this is all that is shown on the contract. This is not good. So you go to read contract, you go to write contract, and, you know, so maybe you can possibly withdraw if you interact directly with the contract. Um, but the code... It's, it's like it's, it's not really looking all that good you know it's, it's just like it looks like maybe it's something basic to so just put something together get people in and probably rub pull everyone all right because like when you got more secure uh, decentralized projects the code is a whole lot more complex than this okay now I'm not I'm not claiming to be a code reader or anything like that um, but you can tell the difference between those legit projects and the ones that not legit okay and I didn't I didn't see this as a legit project at all and it just took me a while to get to this video because there's so many other things going on in the online investment space uh, where people are getting rug pulled and, and now people are just tired of it and you know so you come over here let's go to YouTube real quick 
and let's go to Tron Treasury. And you know, so you got Flood Form, of course, for promoting this thing. Oh my goodness, man, this guy. If, if, if there's a, a case being built up right now, he, he, he's guilty as charged. He, he will not be able to deny anything in in the, in the court of law at all. Um, it doesn't matter if you're saying that this is a casino, which is really not. Casinos are regulated. And, you know, then he, he'll, probably, he'll say something dumb like, well, crypto isn't, so deal with it. And just like it's stupidity. But people like him are the reasons why people are getting tired of being rug pulled. Um, and, you know, when I, when I went over to these channels of people promoting Tron Treasury, they was not showing any, like, official way of communicating with the actual project itself. I could not find, a, uh, you know, like a, a Twitter link or X, whatever you want to call it, platform X link. Uh, Telegram, Facebook, WhatsApp, I couldn't find none of that besides their own links. And I'm, I'm looking for the official link. You know, here, here we got Terrence Pounds. So, you know, we can go figure, right? He, he, he promotes everything, you know. So, but if you see these people right here promoting anything, it's automatic red flag, okay? Now, unless you love this kind of things, go for it. But there's a lot of people that are literally tired of losing now. And I know that y'all see that. Y'all see the complaints. But you still continue to promote these kind of things, right? I got tired of doing what you guys are doing. And I had to make a change. And that's what I did. And so this right here is not looking good at all for Tron Treasury. There's not a whole lot of content talking about Tron Treasury. Um, there, I looked on, on Facebook for the groups that's promoting Tron Treasury. Nobody's saying anything about this right here. And also about the contract, you know, so I don't know what's going on. I just know that the creator's contract has all of the Tron right over here. So y'all might want to get in contact with the creator to see if y'all can get your money back. If the, uh, if this is what's going on, you can't access your account and you want access to your funds, get in contact with the person who's responsible for creating the project so you can try to get your money back. All right. Uh, I don't know what else I can show you here. I don't know what else I can tell you. And this is right here, just a funny situation altogether. I, you know, the website is gone. Wayback Machine cannot access the website. You know, even if I copy this um, URL and put it over here, and nothing still comes up. And uh, you know, so if I click on this link right here to try to view other URLs, nothing comes up. I came and pulled up an old website that was saved. And when you look at that radar, it goes, it started back in October. And it's already over in December. You know, I was hoping to have at least one saved listing on, on Wave That Machine to be able to view the website and see what was the official way of communicating with the project. So I could try to see if they have some, some type of announcement. If you're involved with Tron Treasury and you have that announcement, please share it with me in the comment section. Because I don't know what's going on here. I don't know if this is a rug pull or a DDoS attack. Because they have no DDoS protection. When you come over here to the domain lookup, there's no DDoS protect, um, protection here. You know, and just so that you can understand, let's say like, uh, you know, uh, uh, the recent rug pull, Corpy AI. You, you look up Corpy AI. And you see right here, they got DDoS, guard.net. So they got DDoS protection, but they said that DDoS attacked them. You know, their own DDoS guard attacked them, stealing the funds pretty much, but there was no announcement of a lawsuit against DDoS guard or Namecheap. Or Namecheap. That's, the, that's the, uh, the, the company went through for the registration of their domain name. And you see that Aspire's on update on, that's no longer available anymore. That used to be there when I first reviewed this. And so when you look at Tron Treasury, they have no DDoS protection. That's why I cannot come to a conclusion if this is a rug pull or, 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 or a DDoS attack. I don't know. But I do know this as well. The balance in the contract is not looking good at all. It's only showing that it's over $10,000 here. So went from 
You know, you go right here, you got over 85.88,000, and it's showing it's showing here a volume of $567, but you know, I'm looking at the uh, the line is over ten thousand dollars inside the contract, and that's what I had saw. Let me see where is. Let me see. I'm gonna try to refresh the screen to see if that number will show up again. Oh, it must have updated because it was showing that two hundred and fifty-eight thousand was here when I first looked at this thing. So it must have updated. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, it had to update. So. Yeah, I, I don't know what I don't know what to say. This right here is a, uh, it's going to be a scary situation for many of you because you invested into this thing with people that you found to be trustworthy. And there's so many people I've seen in other uh, Telegram groups that shares opportunities like this or other opportunities that for passive on online income. And I'm looking at the complaints. Everyone's complaining about how they're tired of losing money um they're looking at getting into uh at real affiliate marketing so uh and then also learning how to trade on their own and, and the list goes on people are trying to find ways of making a legit online income instead of getting into these promise to pay platforms like tron treasury like copy ai like itp the list goes on so if you want those people that's tired of that hey join the crowd I got tired of it as well, and I started looking for legit opportunities to grow my money in a passive way that's not promised me to get rich overnight or in a month's time or a year's time, nothing like that. Because that's not possible, okay? Not, not unless you're born into a rich family or you win a lottery or you win a major lawsuit. That's that's the only way that you'll be able to get rich pretty much overnight, okay? So that's all to say. If you like what you heard and saw, please like subscribe to the channel. Also, feel free to share this video to other people. Uh, I don't know what's going on here with Tron Treasury. I don't know if it's a DDoS attack or a rug pull. You know, based on the information I, I'm able to see. Uh, so if you got any more information, like I said before, please share that in the comment section. Let me know what's going on. Uh, so that way I can give an update video of what's going on. Alright, so thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time in this video. Take care, everyone.